On the floor for the visiting Boston Celtics. At point guard, Marcus Smart. At power forward, Al Horford. At center, Robert Williams. At the other guard position, Jalen Brown. At the other forward position, Jason Taylor. The head coach of the visiting team is Ime Udoka. Now it's in the starting. said, quote, careers go this way or that, so you never take anything for granted. When you have something, you roll with it. Not waiting for a draft pick. You win now. And I think that's what the Miami Heat is all about. Right now. Well, Allie, they want to stay in the mix. Good reporting there. And let's take a look at Boston's starting lineup. At the two and the three, Brown and Tatum. Al Horford out there with Robert Williams. And it's smart in at the point. And for the Heat, Inside, it's Adebayo with Tucker playing the four. Manning the backcourt, it's Lowry and Robinson. And it's Butler in at the three. You take a look at Miami. They're trying to take the upper hand in what's been a tight series to this point. Yeah, I mean, we're down to a best-of-three situation now. And with the berth in the finals at stake, these are going to be some tense games. I like their chances tonight, but I wouldn't be surprised if we're back here in a few days for game seven. Here we go. It'll be the Celtics off the tip. Outside, Brown. Tatum against Butler. And Tatum, here we go. Adebayo with the rejection. And he's able to get it back. The reach of Bam Adebayo is off the chart. Using it well with that block. Just two to shoot. And it's smart missing. Wow, that's one you just kind of assume is going in. Tough luck. Out to the wing. Pass to Lowry. Outside Butler. Back to Lowry. Butler, a screen on Tatum. For three, Lowry! Smart grabs the miss. For Boston, they've gone 0 for 3 from the floor to begin this one. Outside, Brown. Long range. He drains that one after two misses. Now one for three. There's no lack of confidence in Tatum when it comes to his three-point shot. He's looking to do damage from long range on every possession. Now here's Butler. It's not going to go for him. A rare miss for him at point-blank range. That's one he'd like to have back. 
Smart passes to Brown. With the drive. Bank it in off the glass. Brown taking on all challengers. This kind of fearless approach is what his teammates and coaches love seeing. Lowry against Smart. Pass to Adebayo. Who poked away. And here's Smart. Outside Tatum. Williams up top. Brown against Robinson. The kick to Tatum. Let's it go from deep. Count it. Two for four from the field now. Don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. And he lobs it up top. Abayo, no good. And gearing up for the alley-oop, just couldn't finish the play. You know, this is something you practice over and over again. I'm surprised they couldn't execute. Now here's Tatum. He has six. Over Butler. And Butler with the block. Known for being a strong defender, Butler takes pride in blocking shots. Tucker with a screen. Butler with the ball. Now Horford defending. To the paint. And out of Bio slams it in. Wonderful play. With that long wingspan and huge hands. Otto Bio catches and finishes with the ease. Outside Tatum. For three. That won't go either for Tatum. He's looking pretty unsettled at the moment. Doesn't seem like he has a great feel for his shot. <laughs> Bio, no good. They are out of rhythm. One for five so far. You just need to calm down and reward your matchups. Here's Brown using his coach moves to get the two points. And setting the tempo with an assertive move. Like, where was the defense on that play? No excuse. You have to be aware. He should be on your radar all the time. Out of Iowa, screen on smart. To Adebayo. To the left wing. Here's Tucker. That's good. And so Lowry with the assist. Smart playmaking by Kyle. Moving the ball to a guy with a good look. Checked in for Adebayo. Struess comes in for Butler. Victor Oladipo is checked in for Robinson. And it's Hero in for Lowry. So Boston going with almost an entire new group here. Tice is checked in for Williams. Williams comes in for Horford. White, he's checked in for Tatum. And Pritchard is subbed in for Smart. Here's White. It's hauled in by the Heat. Here's Oladipo. Here's Struce. Misses in close. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. Pass to White. 
Back to Pritchard. 143 left in the first. Shot clock at five. Oh, yes. The turnaround. You know, I have to say, that's about as smooth as you can do it. Fantastic turnaround. Tucker with the ball. Tice defending. Here's Martin. Driving to the basket. Can't connect from short range. Boston's gone two of three from three-point land so far. Outside White. Williams has screened on Hero. Here's White. Oh, he goes up high for the two-handed slam. And the way that White attacks. I love how he asserts himself and takes it to the rim. The layup is good off the glass. Beautiful call that time up the floor. The hard screen frees him up for the bunny. White, the right, pass to Brown. Here's Pritchard. Nails it from three. Pritchard's got five points. They're not wasting any time putting their stamp on this game. What a start. Play calling has been fantastic. They've been a step ahead of the defense since the opening tip. Now here's Tucker. Here's Martin. Back to Hero. 14 feet away. Hits the front of the rim and out. Boston on offense. They're on a 17-7 run. Pass to White. Soft touch off the glass. White's got his second basket of the game. And so it's the Boston Celtics going into the break up 12. They've done well to disrupt the opposition, playing inspired defense back after this. Game five. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for Boston. They didn't need any time to warm up from long range today. Their three-point shooting has been terrific in the first half. Another thing they're having success with tonight is the mid-range jump shot. It's been really falling for them. And here are the Heat now. Down by 12. Heading the backcourt, it's Lowry and Robinson. Damn Adebayo is out there with Butler. And it's Oladipo in at the small forward. That's the group in the game for the Heat. Very surprising. He gets the ball where he wants it in a decent matchup. The ball's knocked loose. Butler with a steal. Pass to Oladipo. Adebayo is screen on Smart. Oladipo into the lane. That one goes in. And due to the coronavirus, many teams played with little to no fans for the entirety of last season. Yeah, B.A., I really felt for the players and fans. We definitely missed out. I never had to do it, but it has to be a huge adjustment, especially when you're playing at home. Here's Pritchard. The Heat making their last shot. Four on the clock. They clock. The Celtics got to hurry here from outside and he almost made them regret defending him so loosely Robinson passes to Lowry now here's Adebayo outside Butler over Williams and stolen by Williams pass to Tatum now here's Smart. Back to Tatum. Five on the clock. The three is up. Oh, wow. Drew the contact, and that three almost went in. So he'll go to the line for three free throws. It goes on Duncan Robinson. At the line for the Celtics, Jason Tatum. Five in the act of shooting a three-pointer. We'll have three free throws. Three shots. Three shots. No 
good on that one. During his rookie year, Jason Tatum battled LeBron in the Eastern Conference Finals. Tatum's been an impact from the moment he joined the league. No good on the second free throw. Third shot, he finally gets it to fall. The Heat have gone just one of three to begin the second quarter. Lowry outside. Oladipo outside. To the middle. And finished off by Adepayo. Throwing off the dynamic athleticism. Bam is no stranger to rocking the rim. Four seconds left. That one goes. Count it. Smart. Smart has got his first basket. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. Here's Robinson. the inside. Horford with a steal. Tatum with it. Now Oladipo defending. Down low. And there's Horford on the assist from Tatum. And the Celtics lead by 13. Look at how Tatum surveys the whole floor. That's how he spots the wide open man. It's Lowry with a drive. Gets his second attempt to go. Now he's one for two. Here's Tatum. Seven points in the game. Second quarter, a little under three and a half minutes played already. With the skills of a guard, Tatum has the size of a power forward. It makes him so tough to stop inside. Now here's Lowry. Defense right on him. And stolen by Williams. Pass to Pritchard. Smart outside. Tatum with it. Here's Pritchard. That falls. Nice feed that time from Tatum. Pritchard's got eight points. Rock solid screen right there. The defender got completely lost. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Substitution here for Miami. Tucker's checked in for Adebayo. Martin comes in for Oladipo. Struess, he's checked in for Robinson. And it's Hero in for Lowry. A big group substitution here for Boston. Tice is checked in for Williams. 
Williams comes in for Horford. Brown, he's checked in for Smart. And it's White in for Pritchard. Butler finds Hero. Back to Butler. Hero against White. Shot clock at six. Here's Hero. Unable to get that one. Good work defensively by White. And you have to think that they're leading this game because of how they've controlled the boards tonight. Pass to Brown. A minute and a half left to play in the first half. And can connect on that one. His first miss. He's two of three now. Here's Butler. He gets it in there. Butler's got his first two points of the night. Wow, the strength of Jimmy Butler fends off defenders well when he goes up to score. Now White. Williams on the wing. Back to White. Stolen by Hero. Left side Butler. Inside. Here's Martin. That shot missing. Now Boston takes it the other way. Williams with the screen. The teardrop. White can't hit. The Heat have gotten four of eight shots to drop in the second. Butler passes to Hero. Back to Butler. Hero on the wing. Shakes him. And no good. Boston has gone four of six from three-point range thus far. Oh, it's stolen by Tucker. And out of bounds. Boston will have it. Outside, Brown. And we finished off one half of play. Celtics out in front, leading by 14. We'll see you after halftime for the beginning of the third quarter. Welcome, everybody. And in this pivotal game, 5 a tremendous performance thus far for the Boston Celtics. They're getting a lot out of their bench. A lot. For the most part, opponent's game plan is to take away the starters. But then, when your second unit comes in and plays with this type of intensity and torches the nets, you created a whole new problem for the other team. Taking a look at how the series is going for the Heat. It's going to be a three-game series here on out. Still, you have to like their chances as they'll have the home court advantage. Yeah, I do, and I think they'll get it done. But even if they fall behind 3-2 in the series, you can't count these guys out, Chad. Yeah, true. I feel like T-I-S-A-S. And no, that's not a tasty appetizer, Kenny. It's an acronym for this is still in your one series. Well, I can change the next two games, guys. Really? I think you can go seven. <laughs> And with our appetizer round all gobbled up, <laughs> that's going to do it for us. We'll send you back now for the start of the second half. Hey, hey Kenny, pass me those chips. from the Eastern Conference Finals on 2K Sports. One of the stories here, Jason Tatum. Man, is he getting it done today? Through the first two quarters, he's been on fire. Explosive offensive performance. This is his challenge, to continue to dominate, to help them try to close strong here in the second half. And with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. On the floor for Boston. Smart and Brown, a great defensive backcourt. Jason Tatum out there with Al Horford. And it's Williams in at the five. 
Now here's Tatum. Nine points in the game. He takes it in. Tries again. Jimmy Butler with a rebound. Butler's got his fourth rebound in this one. He hasn't helped the cause with his shooting, but his teammates have had his back. Lowry against Brown. Pass to Butler. The putback controls the rebound and the putback. Look, when you play against Jimmy Butler, you know you're in for a battle. Excellent job extending the possession. And finished off by Tito. Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. Lowry, the pass to Adebayo. Butler with the ball. Adebayo, a screen on Tatum. Tatum against Butler. Just five to shoot. Shoots over Tatum. A shot by Butler, no good. For Boston, they've gone just one of three in the second half. Here's Brown. Here's Williams. Kicks it out to Smart. From deep, hits the trifecta. Smart has got five points. To stretch out the defense, you just need enough guys on the floor who can make that shot. Outside Butler. And the call will be against Jason Tatum. That's his first foul of the game. Oladipo's checked in for Miami. And the Celtics also making a change. Pritchard's checked in. And we're just about two minutes into the final half of play now. Adebayo sets the screen to shoot and stolen by Williams pass to smart now Brown three-pointer and the Celtics another three <laughs> I just love the ball movement Miami shooting only 33 percent not exactly consistent offense Lowry the pass to Adebayo Outside Robinson. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. Robinson's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. You have to be impressed by Bam Adebayo's playmaking. B.A., he has great vision for a big man, and he helps this team as another initiator. Now here's Brown. He's got seven. Hey, when in doubt, run the defender off the screen. And you know, with a result like that, we'll see them run it again. Especially if the defense is going to allow you to do it. Have to switch on that play. Adebayo, no good. And Coach Steve Kerr of the Warriors, he said Adebayo reminds him of Draymond Green. You know the reason why, B.A., they both are elite ball handlers at the four position. They both anchored the defense on their team. Bam, Adebayo's definitely on his way. Man, the defender really went after First, 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 first team five. Shooting for Boston, Robert Williams. First one falls for him. Martin, he's checked in for Miami. Hero comes in for Robinson. Tice is checked in for Boston. White comes in for Smart. And Williams drops them both. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the third quarter. Hero against White. To the middle. Here's Martin. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Here's Adebayo. Rebounded by the Celtics. Williams has got six rebounds now in the game. 
they've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. Here's Pritchard. Give him eight points now. Back to Brown. Clock at six. Miami grabs the miss. Oladipo outside. Pass to Adebayo. And good. Coming on the setup by Oladipo. Adebayo's got six points. Beasting inside. Adebayo can bully you. And he's also added some finesse. Tice, a screen on Oladipo. Here's Brown. Misses the layup. Miami has gone one for two from outside the arc in this third quarter. Counted from distance. Five points in the game. Set him up, he'll knock him down. Tyler was drafted largely for that dead eye jumper. Celtics call time. in for Lowry. Williams is checked in for Boston. Jason Tatum comes in for Pritchard. to Tatum. Back to White. A minute six left in the third quarter. Back to Tatum. Down to five on the shot clock. Adebayo grabs the board. Miami's gone three of five from the perimeter in this game. Brown against Oladipo. The shot no good. Nice D from Brown. Boston's gone two for two from deep here in the third. Here's Tatum, and it's Miami with a rebound. And for his offense, this has just been a brutal period. Adebayo finds Hero. Here's Truce. Hero outside. Oladipo on the wing. No good with the triple. Boston's gone six of nine from three-point range. Now Brown. to White to the inside Tatum lays it up and in off the pretty assist Tatum's got four points in the quarter they rely on Derek White for good feed he plays on selfish heads up basketball and here at the end of the third it's a double digit ball game Celtics out in front they lead by 18 and we'll have the start of the fourth quarter for you as soon as we get back from this short break Let's take this opportunity to show you our State Farm assist to the game. Ooh, I'm 
I'm fired up to see this dish one more time. It's always great to see your two guards share the wealth. Very unselfish. If you appreciate teamwork, this is the kind of play that will get you up out of your seat. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. Lowry and Hero teaming up in the backcourt. Butler out there with Duncan Robinson. And it's Tucker in at the center position. And that's the group on the floor for Miami. Two trails hit from deep. Growing into his role as a franchise player, Tatum with a huge game. It's been so much fun watching him tonight. Outside Tucker. Pass to Robinson. Hero against White. Here's Hero. He's covered closely. He got a piece of it. Quick off the floor. White tracks that shot and sends it back. Airmail. Williams is checked in for Boston. Robert Williams. Boston has gotten 21 points so far from three-point land. They're seven of ten. Smart outside. Williams passes to White. Williams a screen on Hero. White against Hero. White can't hit. Miami has gone three of six from deep so far. Here's Lowry. Smart with the defensive effort. Coach loves the execution, just not the result. That's okay. That's part of the process. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the fourth. Tatum from long range. That's good. That's now his seventh made field goal in 15 tries. Hey, continue to stack it up from three. He's got two in each half so far. Butler finds Lowry. Butler, a screen on Smart. Here's Lowry. Pass to Tucker. Outside Robinson. And here's Lowry from the arc. Miami, no good that time either. For Boston, they've gone two of three to open the fourth quarter. The shake. Ooh, Tatum slams it home. Give Tatum credit. Getting ideal positioning inside and hammering it down with power. Pass to Tucker. Horford against Butler. Into the lane. And it's Butler with the game. It doesn't get any easier than that. The defense has to play better. Outside Tatum. Outside White. Williams a screen on Hero. White against Robinson. Shoots a fadeaway. White can't hit. So frustrating when you can't get anything to go down as you're trying to help your team finish the job. Robinson passes to Hero. Oh, they get a hand on it. It's stolen by Smart. Ahead. And there's White. That's good on the assist from Smart. Smart has got his fourth assist in this one. And breaking down some numbers here, the hustle stats for the Celtics. They've been playing such pesky defense. It's been very impressive, especially all the turnovers they've caused. They've also generated a lot of points off turnovers over the course of the game tonight. Celtics substitution. A bit under three and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Lowry, the pass to Butler. Four on the clock. Horford pulls it in. Boston on offense. They've outscored them 10 to 2 during this run. Over to the left wing. Back to Pritchard. Butler against Horford. Over Butler. That one a little long. For Miami, they've got one out of six shots to fall in this final quarter. Not ideal. And out of bounds, Boston will have it. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Two. 
157 left in the fourth quarter. Outside Tatum. White on the wing. Just four to shoot. Launches it. And the three-pointer goes. Here in the second half, they're really focused on stretching the floor. This was obviously a focal point coming out of the break. Look smart when the shots are going down. Here's Martin. And he's going for the lob. Well, they came out determined to win, and their play reflected that all night. This will be a crucial Game 5 win for the Celtics. And everything seemed to go their way today. They were firing on all cylinders, Grant. Yeah, B.A., this was the kind of performance you relish as a player. Just a very impressive win. And with this win here tonight, they're now up 3-2. They're poised to win this series and punch their ticket to the NBA Finals. Great to have that one-game cushion, but this can be the tricky part. Closing out a series is never easy, and you have to believe we're going to see both teams giving everything they've got in Game 6. And as it was happening, as it was building, you knew this was a monster game for Jason Tatum. Hard not to be impressed by what he did tonight. He was aggressive, he was efficient, and the defense had no answer. Now here's White. Takes it inside. Denied by Adebayo. Lowry outside. Pass to Adebayo. Butler against Tatum. Now here's Butler, tightly guarded. Tatum with the block. Tatum makes it easy for his teammates with his defense. He's always a threat to block shots, and he can cover any part of the floor. Here's Pritchard. So we see the Celtics taking the W here. And with this win, they've piled on the pressure. They only need one more victory to close the series out. If this was a critical performance, at 2-2, a team season can ride on a game five like this one. They did a terrific job of rising to the moment and taking control of the series. And so this one is in the books. We hope you've enjoyed being with us for the Eastern Conference Finals. For Grant Hill, Steve Smith, and Ali LaForce, this is Brian Anderson. Thanks for watching tonight's game. Last but not least, here is your New Balance player of the game, Jason Tatum.